Bangkok, Thailand, a humid, polluted, tropical, urban jungle. Weaving between some of the most dangerous roads in the world, you'll find the city's second biggest population. In a city of 8 million people, there also lives an estimated half a million street dogs. Okay, uh, I have a story about a street dog, right? Okay. Have the old man stay in Payathai. It all started one morning. Several years ago, there's a guy around here. He act himself like a big shot. So he's sleeping. So I'm just gonna chuck my rubbish in the bin and then the dog just went for me. In Thailand, most animals are left to their own fate. The general belief is that they should roam free rather than become housebound pets. And most likely, soy dog, they have an owner. Or if they don't have the owner, they will have someone who sponsor them, bring them food. Because people who live in the soy, I think they like the dog to be around because at least some stranger show up, the dog will bark, we send you some signal. ซึ่งเอาหมาพันธุ์ต่างชาติมาผสมแล้วก็ถ้าเอามาเลี้ยงมากๆเนี่ยค่ะเขาก็จะแบบเกิดความรู้สึกว่าหมาตัวนี้ร
All of these canines came from one original source. Traffic, umbrellas, flags, things that flap, things that make noises. The wolves are very wary, cautious about, standoffish. She is one step removed from the wild and pretty undomesticated. There is a big difference between domesticated dog and the wolf. Dogs are much more dependent. They're not really capable of fending for themselves. And wolves are really a lot more like people. And then later he have like a two, three hundred, later five hundred dogs and barking every day in the neighborhood, uh, kick him out. And he went to drink and he get drunk. And he come back, he shoot them dog, the street dog. And I pulled his teeth through my skin. And I was surprised, very, very surprised that the judge sentenced him 45 days in jail for killing dog, which has never happened before. There are currently no parks in Bangkok that allow dog walking. But in a highly publicized first, the mayor of Bangkok and a team of Thai celebrities lead a group of dogs on the first ever legal dog walk through a busy park in central Bangkok. To mark the occasion, expensive imported breeds walk side by side with rehabilitated street dogs. The emerging trend of imported pedigree breeds is beginning to change the general attitude towards dogs in Thailand, thinking of them more as domestic animals to be cared for, rather than let loose on the streets to run wild. Although attitudes of ownership may be beginning to change, it's possible that many of these dogs will end up on the street. And a lot of people don't know what the best known dog secret is. Uh, the best known dog secret is dogs have no secrets. 